my name is Dan Schmidt. I do a weekly television show called Team Chicago Challenge. The website is teamchicago.tv, teamchicago.tv. We're looking at some of the action. We're in, Oshkosh, we're in Oshkosh, Wisconsin, on Lake Winnebago, we're with the Otter Street Fisheries. They got their tent up here, their beer tent. The Beaver Motorcycle Club has put the event on, and I'm gonna show you some of the highlights from motorcycle racing on the ice, Lake Winnebago, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. And don't forget the website, teamchicago.tv. First race up is the 250 class. Jumping out front, that's Joe Stoppelworth. Joe Stoppelworth, one of the members of the Beaver Motorcycle Club and the man that laid the track out. He's got a wonderful 250 Looks Yamaha. Like in, in fact, he's going to let me ride it a little bit later in the senior class. Joe Stoppelworth gets a good jump off the line. He's worth 10 lap finals. Joe got a little tired and he's got some jumpers nipping at his heels. Got number 11 and number 16, 57. 57 is Parker Lane. 11 is Christian Johnson. 16 is Joe Stoppelworth. But up front, it is at 57, Parker Lane. Got the hot hand as Joe tries some outside moves going outside. Glare ice, if you can say there. But picking up the, the win, it was Parker Lane. Yeah. That's where we Good battle down to the end between Brady Lane and Taylor Huntsman. Number zero and number seven. Number seven is Taylor Huntsman. Zero on the back street of Yamaha. Also out there on the 50 is Loyal. I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Let's see it. Here they are coming for the second place. Whoa! Photo finish, but maybe Taylor Huntsman, Brandy Lane at the end. Now we're looking at quad action, open pro quad. Second place right now, that's the winner of the heat race. It is Ken Krause. A little bit of water is starting to form on the track, and I don't know if it's water, but Ken Krause is on the slows down, flashing by him. It is Rob Rice, Al Barden, and Matt Schmidt get by. Rob Rains trying to stretch his lead. He's got the good line going through the corners. These are studded quads. Schmidt, but at the end, it was Ken Krause on the gas. He got his squad running better again. He took the outside line. We're going to go down to the wire. Rob Rice, Ken Krause, Rob Rice, Ken Krause, number 18, number 780. Rob Rice is still up front. Ken Krause is right there. He tries them outside line through the puddle on the gas. Oh, not quite making it. Rob Rice picking up the win. Ken Crow, second Al Barton, and Matt Schmidt. As we look at some of the fish, they had a fishing contest, paid $100 to the biggest fish. Four different fishes were fished out here on the ice. We're in Lake Winnebago, right off of Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Hundreds and hundreds of fans of fishing and motorcycle racing on the ice. Now it's my time. Going to Joe Stoppelworth, Joe's Cables, 250. I get a good jump. But this is only a 250. Some of these other guys are on 450s. So they blast by me. It's really tough when you just get on a bike, but I'm having a great time. Thank you, Joe. Thank you to the Beaver Motorcycle Club. Thank you to the Otter Street Fishing Club. Thanks to everybody. What a great event. It's February 4th, 2012. At least I could run competitive on this 250 Yamaha. I am having a great time. Picking up the win in the 250 class. Go you know, check that. The senior class was John Huntemark. And the senior class, the vet class, was Patrick Dampier. Now in the twins class, jumping out front again, it is John Huntemark's. Right with him is Terry Vestal. Both of them on 750 Yamahas. Third place also on the Yamaha is Shannon Reamer. Dan Luncheon is on his Triumph, Trackmaster Frame Triumph. We're going on to pick up the win, two races. John Hundermark winning the Vintage Twins and winning that senior class. 
great racing, great time. And now, look at this battle up front. Open quads, there's a four-cylinder quad with a motorcycle engine, a four-cylinder moving on the outside. He's got some horsepower, but Zach Zitschitz is up front. We see that big bike on the outside. Has he got enough room and enough traction? Zach Zitschitz right there. Brad Tomain is number 16. Matt Grichek is running 19. 144 is Chad Larson. Good battle for second place between Brad Tomain and Matt Recheck, number 16 and number 19. But Zach Zitschitz, he has got the hot hand. He is flying, look at him go through the corners, lifting an inside wheel. And at the end, Zach Zitschitz picked up the win. Brad Tomain was second, Matt Recheck was third, and Chad Larson ended up in fourth place open quad class well, what a sight to see that four cylinder motorcycle engine quad flashing around that track thousands of spectators a great time Otter Street Fishery the website is www.osfc.net as they have their raffle hundreds of prizes were given out everybody had a great time bringing out the dogs. No place ain't going to the dogs. Joe Stoppelworth, besides racing, he was out there doing the announcing. Beaver Motorcycle Club. It's beavercycleclub.com. Thousands of spectators. It's always a great event out here. Lake Winnebago, Oshkosh, Wisconsin. And last up, it is the 450 Amateur, 450 Pro Combined. Jumping up front, that is 48, that's Trey Johnson. Right with him is two amateurs, that's Morgan.